My name is Anne Munches. I'm from Buffalo, New York, and my residency was from October to December 2013. I've been working on some large panel drawings and uh, an installation piece. My focus is primarily on drawing, and a lot of the things that I've been able to do here were sort of explore my theme I use in my work a lot, which is um, about the architecture of the home. And so I came here with a plan to do some larger panel drawings. Uh, I have these Victorian portrait cards that I've been collecting over the years, and I wanted to sort of play off that, uh, that work and start incorporating uh, bodies as homes and play with that idea a little bit. And so it's not a totally concrete idea, but I've been able to sort of explore it a bit while I was here. And then I was also interested in starting a new installation piece. Uh, I have a plan of building a whole house sort of this way where I create sort of encounters of the everyday. So objects that we use and rooms that we occupy and things that we do within our home space, transitioning it into sort of this drawing world. And so I started with the, I keep calling it the laundry room despite the fact that there's no laundry machines. <laughs> Uh, maybe one day there will be, but uh, I started with these objects and just sort of drawing hatches all over it. And um, the idea was to play between the 3D and the 2D, so the flatness of the line drawn on an object versus the actual object being an, a thing. So it was about a year ago that I had the first time I was able to build an installation space, but I think that ever since I've been doing these drawings of interior spaces, I've always sort of dreamed of being able to build them. So every time I made one, I was imagining what it would look like in real life. Um, but last fall, I was able to actually build one. It was like this big 40 foot by 12 foot tall home structure. Um, it's actually a lot of fun just sort of creating the environment and creating the drawing around you and making you a part of that. With the drawings uh, on the panels, um, something I hadn't really figured out yet was the whole drawing process and what I was looking for in the aesthetics of the drawings. So while I've been here, I've been experimenting with color, which is not normal for me. <laughs> um, so maybe in that way, there's been a little bit of sort of an involvement I wasn't planning on, but I sort of had this idea in the back of my head where like, I, was, I knew I was really interested in making a new installation and I knew what I wanted to accomplish with it. So I had my time planned at Bemis so that I would be able to accommodate me being able to work through that. The other thing that's been really nice is I've been able to become really obsessive in some of the stuff I've been doing. Um, I like that. I like being able to sit down and think about it. And I talked a little bit this, about this in my talk last night, but like it's, it, it's more than just thinking about the concepts behind the work. It was thinking about the actual practice of the work. And so analyzing my music, you know, seeing what, what gets me going, like what happens here and there, you know, assigning soundtracks to each piece, which actually helps me remember them better. <laughs> um, and you know, simple things like that, or even understanding like these rules that I draw with, you know, or how I lay out things. And so it's been really exciting to sort of narrow in on those things because it helps me stay focused and interested in what I'm doing.